With so many options available for investing money, Amanda is finding it difficult to decide on the best way to invest hers. She knows that she wants the money to work hard for her and provide some regular income, so a yield investment is imperative. Tony suggests putting it in the bank on deposit, but that's not suitable as they offer almost no interest. Charlie suggests buying bonds. However, that's even worse because not only is the yield low, but rising interest rates and rising inflation could eventually spell losses for a worried Amanda. Finally, Alexandra suggests buying equities. But equities are risky and they don't pay coupons, says Amanda. Was Amanda right? Well, it is true that equities can be more volatile than bonds and are normally seen to be higher risk. It is also true that equities don't pay coupons as such, but equities do pay dividends and provide the possibility for capital gains. The dividend levels on offer seem compelling and Amanda is confident that the extra risk is worth it for the level of return that she could receive. However, she still doesn't know what to buy. She doesn't have enough money to buy her own diversified portfolio of shares and she also doesn't have the expertise to pick the best companies that are likely to pay consistent dividends. Amanda decides to buy units of an equity income fund to give her income from the dividends and potential capital gains from the price performance of the shares. The fund is managed by a team of dedicated professionals who continually look for the best opportunities while keeping the fund portfolio relatively safe by carefully selecting and closely managing the fund's holdings. Over the next few years, Amanda receives 4% per year in income and a couple of years later sells the fund units for 25% more than what she paid for them. Meanwhile, all of her friends who bought deposits and bonds are green with envy. In summary, investors who are looking for a steady income from their invested money can look at high dividend shares as an alternative to bonds. Although equities may carry more risk than bonds, in the current low interest environment, the higher yield that they offer can make high dividend shares attractive. High yielding shares can also offer protection against inflation and the possibility for capital gains if the share price rises. Bonds don't offer these advantages. Investors can access high dividend shares and gain important diversification and the benefits of active management if they invest through an actively managed fund, such as the Threadneedle Global Equity Income Fund.